All right, guys, I'm super hyped right now. Tesla came this morning and installed the full self-drive, the newest hardware, into the car. So check this out. So we're gonna push this button right here. Ah. Ooh. All right, so it's still considered beta. It's pretty much saying that it's going to see traffic lights and stop signs. You still gotta pay attention. It's going to want you to confirm to go through the traffic lights and pretty much they're pretty much saying that pretty much if you ain't paying attention you could still get in a bad car accident so we're gonna try it either way we're gonna work with it i'll let you guys know what i think about this new update isn't it crazy what like the literally the click of a, of a button click of a button update and now it recognizes stop signs when it never did before it's crazy. Technology is amazing. Now it's still in beta, but these are updates that Tesla makes in order, you know, to take steps towards their ultimate vision, which is autonomous driving at the end of the day. So full self-drive. It'll be interesting to see it grow over the course of a couple years, but I think it's gonna take a while to get it to full self-drive. All right, so it's on full self-drive. Here's the traffic light. What does it say? Use accelerator to keep going. Oh, so you use the accelerator, it'll slow down, but then it'll ask you to use the accelerator or the stalk, which is down here, to slow down. All right, so here we go, look at the screen. We got a traffic light coming up. It's slowing down. It's asking me if I wanna keep going, and I do, so it keeps going, because it sees that it's green. All right, traffic light coming up. It's slowing down. No, I'm going, I press the accelerator, and we out. It's working good. It doesn't seem like a major update, I think, for, for most people. I use self-driving a lot, so it's an amazing update to me. Before, I, I could only use the city if there was a full self-drive in the city if there was a car in front of me. Where now, I don't care. I just, when I see a light, it's green, I go ahead and tap that pedal. If not, it's gonna stop. Oh, sh oh it caught. Oh, it's stopping, it's stopping. What? What? You didn't have to do anything? I didn't, no, check this out. So it was green. I pressed the gas pedal to tell it to keep going, but as soon as I pressed the gas pedal, it turned yellow. And instead of it keep going or whatever, over like taking my orders, it, it slowed down and stopped. <laughs> this is dope. Let's see, when that light turns green, if this will recognize it and we'll go. Let's see. All right, it's green. Oh, so it the light turned green and then it asked me if I wanted to go. So it doesn't just go on its own. You gotta confirm that it actually turned green and then it goes. It's just to, to the updates. It's, uh, but it's safe, safety. It's definitely, definitely safe. I don't feel like I'm not gonna use that feature. I'm gonna keep it on. And from what the thing it said before I turned it on, it said that it's gonna get smarter. It's gonna get better. So in the beginning, it might be a little sketchy. Yeah, there's always gonna be updates. Well, not even updates. Like the car is constantly learning. Oh yeah, yeah. Is Calib what it's saying. Before he left, he said that the car in the beginning was had to like calibrate. Yeah. So we'll see if it gets better. I'll let you guys know by the end of this vlog if I've seen improvement. No, not by the end of this vlog because it might take a, a week or two before I start seeing improvements. But I'll let you guys know. Yeah, it is about to storm out here. Oof. It's the worst when you gotta run into the shop and the weather looking like this. The worst. So I'm sitting here, taking this apart, about to try out something exclusive, and I'm showing everybody on Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, you're missing out on these lives. These lives are lit, man. We're gonna test the battery out, see how effective it is, and use it for the next couple weeks or, or whatnot. Just make sure that it's a product that we should bring out to the marketplace. <laughs> All right, so it's plugged in. Let's see, 245. Batteries are plugged in. Slide them in tomorrow. Not tomorrow, but this week, we'll see how they perform. Thinking about you. There it is, it is in, ready to go. That's feeling pretty good, I ain't gonna lie. In my hand, that's feeling pretty powerful, I don't know. We're gonna see how it runs throughout the next few weeks, but man, so far so good. We have a few people already testing them. So far, the feedback has been pretty good, so um, we gotta make some improvements here and there, but that's you know that's the process of developing a product, especially when we're developing one from the ground up. You know what I mean? You're not just slapping your label on something. You gotta engineer the product, you gotta test it. Hopefully, we'll be launching it soon. Yo guys, check this out real quick. So I'm making a green screen, so for my reaction video, Videos and for the boss 
Palacio Builds Wealth channel. And so I was trying to get a green screen, but I want to record a video now. So I don't got time to wait for Amazon. So what I did was I bought this fabric from Walmart. It's green. It's already pre-cut. I think it was like six or seven bucks. And then I bought some of these clips and I had an old TV box for a 70 inch screen that I cut out. So you see what I'm working with here. And so all I'm going to do is kind of just fold all this over it and clip the green cloth onto the cardboard and uh, we should have a, a decent green screen. All right guys, so you guys can see I put it on a tripod. Excuse the mess in the background, but you can see it's just a regular tripod. It's a tripod that I was using for this thing, right? And you can see it looks much flatter now because I ironed it. And there it is. And my computer chair will be right here. Oh yeah, we set now. We good. We good to go. YouTube, what's going on guys? This is the green screen. Check this out. Let me show you guys real quick. I'm going to put a different scene. Boom. Oh, let's put this video on. You guys can see. Hey, that's pretty dope. That's pretty dope. So anyways, you guys can see the green screen, how it worked, real cheap, cardboard box. I think it cost me like 15 bucks to do this. No, not even. It cost me seven plus the um the clips were four, like $12 to do this. I don't know about you guys, but I think it's a pretty dope look. If you guys happen to do it yourselves, let me know in the comments how it worked out for you. YouTube. Real quick, man, we're on the way to the warehouse. We gotta go ship and stuff, along with some other things that I gotta go check out. Been testing some products and stuff that we've been working on for a little while now. But I'm anticipating a package to come in. And this package got some heat in it. I'm telling you, some new clippers, new trimmers. Can't wait to show you guys. Yeah, a lot of things planned today, uh, aside from normal family craziness with these crazy kids. I'm not crazy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys remember, we were on the forklifts. Dre did a terrible job on the new forklift. And lately, he's been opting for the whole forklift a bunch. What's that about? A hater dog. I see you, bro. A hater dog. Take it to the old forklift these days? Man, you don't want no problems on the new forklift, bro. I've been practicing. Bro, you ain't been on that new forklift since the last I vlog. All right. And, and on the fast speed, too. Not on the turtle speed. We gonna see. So Dre was talking about doing a time lapse because we're moving warehouses in September. This warehouse right here. Don't say September like it's far. We're moving next week. Next week? It's September, bro. Damn, it is. <laughs> oh my gosh. So check it out, guys. We have to move all of this, okay? All of these racks. On the other side of these racks, I don't know if you guys can see down there, there's more racks. We got to move the office. We got to move a lot of stuff. Next week to the new warehouse. I'm so excited about. Is this our fourth warehouse or fifth? <laughs> so we started in the garages. So technically, this is going to be our fifth warehouse in like the last year or so. Man, thank you guys so much for all the support, man. We're growing. And to be real with you, man, considering the times, man, like, damn. You know, things could be so much worse. You know what I mean? So we're definitely blessed. We're going to continue to push, man. Get over this challenge with this pandemic. Man, I've been thinking about it too. I miss the shows. I miss the touring. Like the touring for a while started to get too much sometimes. All the traveling and stuff, being away from the family. But I think, you know, we're definitely gonna go back on tour again. I don't know how often. It ain't gonna be like, you know, twice a week type thing. It might be like once a month type type thing. Hit a couple cities and then the following month hit another couple cities, that type of thing. Considering the times, man, like trying to look at it in a positive way. Half, half glass full, like I always say. In a world where we're so busy and we're clocking in, clocking out, cutting hair, working and grinding, for a lot of you guys, this was the first time you really had some time off in, in a long time where you could really think about life, think about, reflect, and uh, hopefully you guys are strategizing for what's going to happen in the future, what your plans are. You've learned from this, like we've learned from this. Looking forward to some normalcy, right? I'm raising the, the featuring price to, 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 to. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about? I told him I was working on my album and I needed a feature. <laughs> Elijah said he was the best and rapper. And he told me that his feature is only $500. So I said, shoot, I'm going to have my people call your people. <laughs> so then he came out and he was like, bro, he talked to his people and now he had to change up the pricing. 
Who do you think these people are? And wh who's the pe who's? Oh, you. The manager. Yeah, You're yeah. the manager. And what's the price? Five million dollars. Golly. It's light though. I got you, bro. That's, a, that's, that's a hell of a feature. You, All right, let's get back to work. Guess what we did today, guys? One of the funnest things ever. After the warehouse, we went to Walmart for about six thousand hours and went school shopping and spent my whole life savings. School shopping, man. These days, you can open your own school after school shopping. They're gonna get a whole bunch of comments about like, really, you're gonna complain about school shopping when these teachers half the time have to come out of their own pockets? Watch. I respect the teachers, my bad, my, my bad guys, my bad. I'm the first one to say teachers need a raise, all right? All right guys, but guess what's here? The package is here, I was afraid it was gonna get stolen because from my front door before. Really? Yeah. Check it out, guys. Custom FX, full effect. So give me a second to bring all these bags in, and then we're gonna unbox. All right, so I'm not gonna record myself unboxing this. I'm gonna pass this to my son. <laughs> Elijah, you gonna be able to handle this, bro? Yeah. All right, here you go. All right, come over here, let's record this. All right. Oh, come here, come here. What'd that say? Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Hey, unlimited possibilities. I like it, I like it. All right, first up. Are those the ones that I designed? Yeah, these are the ones you designed, babe. Not those green ones. Oh. I didn't design green, I designed white. We're gonna have to talk about that. <laughs> so the one that you designed, I actually swapped with the ones Perez designed. Not because I didn't like yours, but because Perez is gonna do a giveaway on the barber session. So I'm sorry. So he's gonna give the way that I designed? No, he designed his own. That's not even a thing? He designed his own. <laughs> what a waste of my time, seriously. Look <laughs> that. So Hello, green. Hello. <laughs> so this has the taper blade on it. Guys, so check it out. So we got this one, right? So we got this one. So we got that one. Check these out. Look at that. So, matching boys. Both with the with the graphite blade. That's it, these are my new hitters. That's crazy. Look at that, man. I'm loving it. Damn. Perez, I'm sorry, I'm gonna show them. I'm not gonna take them out the packaging, but I'm gonna show them. Oh, those are nice. Those are nice, Perez. So those are the trimmers. Now look at the clippers. I ain't gonna lie, those look really, really nice. You seen these, babe? So they match his colors of the bomb session. Mm, okay. Not uh -huh. better than the ones that I did, but they're nice. They're not better than the ones you did? Okay. They definitely ain't better than mine, but they're nice. Bro, that's it, these gonna be, I'm gonna put in some work with these. Are oh, they already gap? Yep, yeah, they already zero gap. We good to go, I think. I'm gonna adjust them just a little bit, but I think we good to go. Sheesh. I appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. Like always. Oh wait, we got some extras in here. So this is uh, to keep your clippers in. Keep them from, um, so when you're traveling, you can keep them safe. Boom. It, like, it has like a snap close. Look, babyless face mask. <laughs> That's dope. What is this? Let's see what this is. Oh look, babyless fanny pack. That's pretty dope. Babe, you want one? Babyless fanny pack? It's dope, right? Perez, you're not getting the fanny pack, bruh. Why are you looking at it, Elijah? Well, you want it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's it, guys. Elijah, thank you, Poppy, for holding down the camera. I appreciate it. Anything you want to say? Don't have me as your cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> you're learning, Poppy. You're learning. All right, so that's it, guys. That's uh, the vlog. Unbox some pretty cool stuff that I can't wait to use them in my next videos. I'm probably going to mess with the internals a little bit. Might put a battery in these. I'm not really sure yet. We're gonna test some of the batteries out first and then I'll see about messing with those, extending the battery life and putting them in here. But aside from that, look out for the giveaway we're gonna do with these. You got a matching set here. So look out for the giveaway for these beauties, okay? It's gonna be a um, giveaway probably for the barber session, probably with Christian Perez. If you're not aware of the barber session, that you're probably not gonna be aware with this giveaway. So make sure you're paying attention. I'll definitely inform you guys if you follow me on Instagram or follow Headlines or Bust on Instagram as well. We'll get you guys the information to enter the giveaway for these custom FX's. That's it, that's the wrap. You wanna say bye? Bye. And what else? <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> Smash the like button. Smash the like button. You, you know, you know, come on. Comment below, Comment let my below. daddy know what you think about the video. <laughs> Why you getting so camera shot out? <laughs> All right, guys, we out of here.